everybody out here in the shop tonight and we have a Honda Talon that's a 2020 Honda Talon and we are gonna mount KFI plow on it so there's the mount bracket we got to get the mounting bracket on it and then the push tube and then the plow so it's our first plow we're gonna install see how this goes we got a players here need some wheel bearings service oil change got most of it done just got to get the uh, wheel bearings in it and we have a LTZ 400 that is rough <laughs> um, got a new wiring harness in it just trying to sort out some wiring issues and once that's accomplished hopefully it's gonna run um, there's the plastics over there under the bench don't have much for bolts for the plastic but once uh, it's running they're gonna take it back and they're gonna finish it so let's hope this thing runs before too long but anyways right now I'm gonna work on this Honda Talon try to get the mounting bracket on it for the plow and the uh, push tube and uh, that's my little project right now. Man, it's sleek looking. I like these. I think the wife really likes these things. So this may be the side-by-side -side of choice for us. Be pretty nice. Just got to make sure it fits in the camper. Which I think it will. Doesn't seem to be too high. Definitely want 30-inch tires on it. I think they're 15-inch rims by the looks of it. 28-inch tires. So we'll see. We'll see. We'll do some measuring. But we'll worry about that when, uh, you know, crossing that bridge when we get to it. But right now, let's get the mounting bracket on it. I don't know. It looks like it may, uh, may be a two-person hand or a two-person job or an extra hand or something. But we're going to we'll give her a shot and see what happens. Sleek looking machine. All right. Let's get on to this thing. Looks like uh, these two bolts right here, one on that side and one on that side, <clears throat> excuse me, have to come off and they will bolt up through here. And then there's some going in the back, um, way underneath. It looks like it's going to be hard to get a hand in there. So we'll see how that goes, but uh, we're going to get them two bolts out and uh, get the bracket mounted up onto there. There's a little bracket down in there that I put down in there and then it lines up them bolts them two bolts hanging down right there um, lined up pretty pretty decent um, now I'm just gonna tighten them bolts down them four bolts the one there the one there they're gonna hold the bracket on I guess that bracket can stay on there year-round like a skid plate if you want it to you don't have to take it off but that will be up to the owner. But I'm gonna get these tightened down and then uh, see what the next step is. All right, so basically this bracket right here is gonna be the where the plow hooks up to and that can come off in the spring then that one can be left left on there as a skid plate but uh that skid plate mounted up really nice so i figured i'd have to struggle with it a little bit but hopefully this mounts up just as easy we'll see Yeah, these four holes right here, they already got the uh, threads mounted right in it. So there's no holding nuts or anything like that. So that's going to be fairly easy, I'm thinking. Another bracket right here. 
and the threads already locked into it and two bolts so let's see they got to go down in there somewhere All right, here's the push tube. Mikey's here to do his mechanical magic on uh, the old bearings on the old popo. We got another popo outside just showed up, needs some work. But uh, gotta get the plow on this first. So here's the push tube. Let's get this thing installed. Got those in there. We have to tighten them down. All right. I think everything is. Uh, I think everything's on the plow that needs to be on there. Got some extra washers and stuff for the shoes there. I don't know. I have to do some adjusting there. But uh, looks good. Time to mount it. Look at that baby right there. That is a plow. Sweet. Yeah, definitely. KFI plow, the KFI winch. Nice. That is ready to go out of here. Hey, and there it is, the Honda Talon. KFI plow, looks pretty sweet. Uh, needs a little adjusting on the blade. But I figure the uh, homeowner's gonna probably wanna adjust it to where he wants it, so we'll let them do the final adjustments. But that is a sweet looking ride with a sweet looking plow. Our first plow sold and installed on a nice bike. So, here it is. Gotta love it. Pretty, pretty nice. Got a KF, KFI winch. And uh, well, it was very nice. Wouldn't mind one of them myself. Well, good looking ride. <laughs> 